Okay, guys, uh, we're here and welcome to Archland. This is actually my account. I've reached level 60 probably a week ago. I just had haven't had the time to give you guys an update and I've acquired a lot actually. A lot of heroes already since the last uh, account showcase. So with this account showcase, let us uh, just go to... I'm, I, I don't want to bore you with uh, my progress here. Um... Just want to go through the tree here. This one almost finished. I'm actually here uh, doing work with these guys here. And I'm actually here already uh, unlocking these two. So soon I'll be unlocking level 14. I'm just uh, generating enough resources for this one so academy wise what is my progress so what i've been doing is prioritizing warrior boost mage boost secondly next is tank boost and priest boost those are my priorities so far i'm actually working on mage boost at as of this moment so again this um this is really really hard to level up as you expect it to be so so far i'm happy with my progress very happy in fact and quietly been playing this game um daily actually i'm really really happy uh that i play this so in terms of what i have saved up a couple of resources already especially these ones here so sorry excuse me sorry for that Actually, I'm hungry. I'm not full. I'm hungry. So in terms of uh, this one, Night Brawl, I haven't played much with Night Brawl. Um, don't have the time you to grind this. Um, I'm also playing another game. Battle Arena, I'm at 16. Uh, I don't grind this too much and spend resources for this. I just spend... I just finished the three. Then for Secret Realm... Um, there are a lot of things that I have to finish, guys. I tell you, I've been busy for the past few days that I haven't gone through. I, but I, I just made sure that I finished my dailies and everything. Made sure that I opened this already. So this one for the hard, these are all opened. So I'm good to go uh, with the skills that I have for my heroes. Uh, almost, I think all have already at max um, traits. So that's uh, speaking of heroes. Let's move through. Uh, by the way, the interface right now, the green one, the highlight, I like it because it pops out. It doesn't blend with the background. So kudos to the devs for having um, this type of um, interface in terms of the event. Let's go to the heroes. Okay. So, so far, these are my heroes. Most of them are at rank 4. Uh, the only... the only We have rank 5 Gabriel here. And rank 5 Clarice, which I really... I, I'm, I got two copies of her in pull. So, again, um, I just wish that it could have been a different hero with a dupe. But uh, I cannot complain at this point. So, let's go back to my heroes here and explore... Um, equipment, most of them are ready, rainbow colored, and trait, so I'm, for Sighard, I'm go, I got, I got, I went with the top, so, again, I told you guys, I'm actually full with them, rune-wise, I'm really good, so, just, uh, lacking a couple of resources, or gold, so, moving to next, we have Charlotte here. Charlotte, yeah, you, you guys know she's one of the best. So I have her gear here. Trait-wise, I got the one in the bottom. So for rune-wise, I'm ready. Kind of good with her. Uh, just need to take these to 20. Again, lacking gold. For Gabriel, also good. So gave her additional HP to withstand more beating from, you know from from enemies so equipment wise uh actually i'm contented with the equipment that she has trait wise this is where i have a problem still i don't know how to reset the top row i thought at 60 we could reset them 
um, apparently at this point no but i assume that will will be going beyond 60. so as of now i'm missing this i cannot farm this anymore and uh, take this this is you know plus three percent to every stat it's actually invested here so i'm actually paying for a mistake an earlier mistake that i did so it's not a problem i don't think it's going to be a problem i just hope that i can get this in the future and i think that we can actually get all of the trees or all of the skill or trait uh levels here or trait rows i don't know what to call them at this point so that is it for gabriel um recently i was able to get ygg um after that summon video i got her and so far she doesn't disappoint charlotte killer at this point and i like her kit i like her kit very very impressed so so far i'm actually i'm getting her exclusive uh, weapon or exclusive equipment straight wise i got the bottom row for her so very nice um she's a support kind of support mage she supports the warriors and for her rune i gave her um damage more damage with the wand and this one is for critical rate because her kit it revolves around crit rate and uh moving to Jin. Jin, i haven't used well um he's actually my third ward in my team but um he's kind of a situational guy i don't use him um that often so equipment wise i'm actually happy with this equipment straight wise i got the bottom row and the rune that i have for him is a vampire set because of he lacks really survivability but he has crit rate here with monstrous wolf okay so moving on i think now i'm gonna you know apologize if i didn't you know didn't um see the potential of valak but now she's my favorite mage at this point she gives a lot of firepower uh buffs again firepower buffs to the team i like her for pvp already and even for pve i'm actually bringing her so she's a support priest who can deal a lot of damage deal damage decent damage not a lot equipment wise i don't have her exclusive one so but i'm happy with how she's built so far i got the bottom row for her i don't ha still have this i don't have uh uh this girl here I don't have Lina. And for her rune, I, of course, healing wise. And this one is just for additional firepower, the magic eye. Okay, one of my favorites, which I really, really worked hard to level up, is actually Michael. So, Michael here. Um, again, for PvP, I enjoy using her. To take off stragglers for team buffs and the like equipment wise i was actually very very fortunate i got her unique equipment with another unique equipment in one pull so very happy with that straight wise i got the top one but i'm not using both skills i'm actually using these two this one and this one so but for rune of course, it's the axe and the uh, holy sword because of normal damage attack. Usually, I would do normal damage attack just to poke, you know, poke damage at the enemy. So, that is how I built her. Next up, we have here Susie and Susan. One of my favorite mages in terms of damage and, and debuffs. Clearly, in terms of damage, they are one of the top. I I like using them, especially in situations where I need to stun somebody. And uh, more or less, um, two buffs and this skill will stun them. And equipment-wise, still no unique equipment. It uh, doesn't matter at this point. I like how, how they're built. I got the, the, the bottom row. But for their uh, rune, I got 
the hourglass because again this one is a chance at skill reduction so hourglass is pretty much difficult to get and this one is additional magic attack okay moving on to Catherine Catherine I'm enjoying as well I've been using her as a support mage not so much for damage more on support um, equipment wise really happy with her sometimes I use raid PV PVP trait wise I got the bottom row and for rune I actually I'm using this inflicts one random debuff 50% but I'm planning to switch to the hourglass if I have enough so probably in the future this will be our glasses I'm gonna be switching the, these out as of now I don't have much so there you go this one Clafare uh, top healer as always I don't have any complaints with her straight wise I got the bottom row and rune is heals this one is for HP additional survivability Okay, next up is Marguerite. So for Marguerite, um, I'm not using her much. Um, probably just if I need a light element, I will use her, but not so much. I have tons of mages in my lineup that I don't use her that much. I have, if you can see here, I have one, uh, two, three, and she's the fourth. So I have three I have four mages and she's the fourth in terms of usage. Equipment wise I have her unique equipment. Straight wise, I got the top. Um she's actually versatile. I, I like her kit as well. So I have our glass here. I put our glass on her instead of Catherine. She needs it more. Um and I put magic eye here for magic attack. Okay. Next up is Semi. Semi here. Um, I haven't been using Semi really because of Michael. It's Michael's fault. <laughs> so um, don't have your unique equipment still. Straight wise, I got the bottom. So it's really full. Rune wise, um, she has Battle Axe and she has Gladiator. So still need to get more battle axes okay so one of uh, recent acquisitions is richard richard is i still have to build him i'm not really confident with him yet i'm still waiting for her, his unique equipment so hopefully after ygg then him as you can see their decent equipment not really the best for him uh, trait wise I am actually going after the top row so far and rune wise I have uh, this one the kite shield for your defenders and the Ouroboros is just for HP so that's it so hopefully if if I plan to really you know invest in him I'll swap out Gabriel for him in PvP eventually eventually but as of now he's in the works in terms of combat power it is at 29 Gabriel is at 36 so really not a you know equal contest at this point so also moving on to Erica so Erica here also happy with her build um, so far the recent uh, unique equipment that I got is hers which is very helpful in, in, in terms of increased range Straight wise, I'm still finishing up the top row, but I'm actually using her in terms of her basic attack. So single unit assassin, um, that's her build and her rune here. Uh, so I have here battle axe as well and crit rate. So built like an assassin, the shooter. So, so far, that is my main team. I haven't been using... Um, our main character and Nola is was parked because of YGG in favor of YGG but she has decent equipment here but I don't use her much 
as you notice and this is her gear um i when i got ygg obviously i stopped you know developing her at this point and uh, these guys when they become ssrs i'll be using them then this girl clarice i haven't been using her i have a lot of assassins don't know what to choose at this point so she's there for you know development and Zelvinath is the last SSR that I'm, you know, the current one that I'm, um, I'm uh, what do you call this? I'm building. I don't use her. Probably will 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 park her. I'm gonna be using more of uh, more of Michael instead of Zelvinath. So if seen my if you've seen my video in terms of build guide, then good. If not, go over to that video uh, if you wanna build her up. And in terms of how to use her as well. Also, Avia is still here. She's the last. I'm still just waiting for them to turn SSR. The rest of them here, I'm not building anymore. So I've concentrated with a lot of heroes anyway. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Right now, I have 14 heroes that I am mixing and matching in terms of matchups, in terms of stages, and I'm very, very happy where I am with them at this point. So that is it, guys. So what, how, what do you think of my account? Um, hopefully, you guys have you know questions for me in the comment. How did I build? Who and you know how how did I build? Uh, what did I use? So throw your questions on you know on my account whatever questions you have there so again guys thank you very much for staying this far take care stay safe this is the warden and i'm out of here